Okay, I'm going to do a little walkthrough of the third island here and how to get to the catamaran and to get the second escape off the island. So first you come here at South Beach Volcano and it's pretty um, obvious. You climb up the hill, you go through Volcano Jungle, that eventually leads to Geyser Plains. So we're going to start there. Now from here you're going to need all of the hieroglyphics. You take all nine of them and you put them with the uh, hardwood building bench. You're going to make a steel out of them. And that is going to be what you place into the door over here. And that will be how you travel to the Intemple interior for the first time. If you haven't escaped the island at all, you can watch my other video and see where to go from here. This is the temple interior. If you want to escape the island with the radio transmitter, you want to go through the door over here, up the stairs, and transmit and get rescued off the island. The other way to go is down these stairs here, and we're going to come across into the temple exterior area. And once you get to the temple exterior, you can go straight down the stairwell, or you can come off to the left here, come off of the stairwell, and there's a lot of new plants that you've never seen before. There's cocoa, there's coffee, coffee beans. So there's a lot of plants that you could spend time harvesting here. So I suggest you take this route. When you're done in this area, go back over here to the stairwell. Now if you go down this way, this is going to be the ancient stairway. This we have already explored if you've escaped the island in the opposite direction. I hope that makes sense. So we're going to go across here now and we're going to head to the ancient amphitheater. Come on. Now this is the area where we're going to perform the cliff dive. That's one of the goals that you'll need to meet. I played this earlier so I already met my goals so you won't see it come up on the screen. So in this area there's a lot of sisal. There are tons of different orchids, red orchids, blue orchids, white orchids, so make sure you stay here for a while. And when you're ready, get your sim that has 10 body strength. A sim with anything less than 10 will die. And you want to travel to the tidal pool. As long as your sim has at least 10 body, they'll still be alive at the bottom. And when you land for the first time, you're going to get a message that you found half of a treasure map piece and that the other half is in a shark's belly. So what you're going to have to do is come back here with your fishing rod and fish for a shark. It could take a few minutes. It could take hours. So what I usually do is I come all the way down and I swim across. Just keep swimming as far as you can go and you'll come over here to North Volcano Beach and this is the area that you are going to escape the island the second time from. Now this is also where you complete the goal to find the final beach and we're going to run down here there's going to be these, the ancient pier like we've had in the past, and it says craft catamaran, so we're going to press OK. And this is what you need for a catamaran. Uh, you need the second axe, a body of 10. You're going to need 50 softwood, 30 hardwood, 30 sandalwood, 50 cotton, and 15 rope. So I'm almost there. As soon as I get the rest of my rope, I am going to be off of this island. So that is how you get there from the beginning of the third island all the way through the second rescue and check out my other video and you'll see how to do the first rescue starting at the temple interior. So now I'm going to craft the rest of my rope and then I will record my final escape from the island. I did want to say that there are additional ways to get here. If you look behind me there's another portal back there but the route that I showed you is the best way to complete all of the goals that you will need to complete. Things like uh, jumping off the ceremonial cliff dive, 
finding a shark and finding the uh, rest of the treasure map pieces. Alright, I now have everything I need to make the catamaran, so I'm going to craft. Again, to do this, you're going to need full health and a generally happy attitude. Hooray, next stop home. And now I'm going to escape the island for the second time. And I'm going to put a link in my profile to the other escape. Alright, now I do want to return to the island and continue the game because I still have goals. And a lot of you have asked what happens now. You just play. I can look at my goal book here. If you happen to have finished all the goals, then the game is pretty much over. You can play free play or it's just over. Um, if not, there's still a couple of goals left here. Let me see what I still have to do. I still haven't fished a shark. I need to harvest an egg, and I haven't done any of these pirate guides retirement. So basically, I have retired to the island. I can leave any time I want to, but I've decided to come back and live here for the rest of my days. So again, if anyone has any questions, feel free to email me, and I'll do the best that I can to answer them.